In this question, the principal explains to us that the offense of kidnapping does not depend upon the time period for which the minor was kept away from the lawful guardianship. Rather, it depends upon the intention of taking the minor out of the custody of lawful guardian. Now, the explanation in the present question provides that whoever takes or entices any minor out of the keeping of the lawful guardian of such minor without the consent of such guardian is said to kidnap such minor from lawful guardianship. That is, it explains what is the meaning of kidnapping from the lawful guardianship. The facts in the present question are X induced a minor girl Y to marry him which she readily agreed and they married in a church in a secret manner. After the marriage, Y immediately returned to her parents' house and lived there as before. Which of the following derivations is correct? In this question, the correct answer is A. That is, X committed the offense of kidnap of Y. Now, from the facts and the principle, a few things have been established. First, the marriage of X and Y puts an end to the existence of guardianship of Y in her father. Secondly, the guardianship of Y after the marriage with X lies with the X, not her father. Thirdly, the offense of kidnapping of Y, the girl, was complete when X took her to the church. And this was a brief moment because in the church they were married. And the marriage of X and Y also brought an end to the lawful guardianship of Y but which also makes it clear that X did commit the offense of kidnapping Y just before the marriage making A the correct answer.